Welcome to my channel, King Kobe here. Today we are going to educate ourselves on Virtual DJ again, right? So today we are going to talk about the sampler. What is it about the sampler? Yes, we know that to play your sampler, you, you either have to go to your sampler and then click on it to play, or you would have to, I mean, set some key mappings for them. So we are, going, we are not going to look at mapping keys to each sampler. Today we are going to look at how to control the volume of each sampler, right? How to control the volume of each sampler. Now, most often, if you want to change the volume of your sampler, all you can do is that you change from the grid mode to the list mode, and then you can just increase or re reduce the volume size based on your preference or based on how loud or minimal the sound of the sample is, right? So we would want to do this action with our keyboard. So we have to map a key for that purpose. So that is what we are going to do today. So fast forward, I will have to go to my settings and I will use the num minus and then the num plus for this. So what we'll do is we we'll just type sampler underscore volume, right? Sorry, so sampler underscore volume volume so this is what we want and then we want to reduce um so this minus so we want to reduce the volume by let's say five percent let's see how how the five percent will do so what it means is that it is only going to affect the sampler that is on focus or the, the focus sampler so if i have clicked on the saxo it is a saxo volume that is going to affect right so let me save this and then we'll, we'll test it out and see so you can watch what is going on what what is going to happen on the saxo sample so you can see that the volume reduces by five percent whilst i press the minus so we'll have to do same to increase the volume so i'll use the num plus for this and i'll paste it and then now i'll do plus right sorry plus five great and i'll save it right so if i do the if i press a plus you can see that the volume is increasing and reducing so if it is the let me say let me reduce this and then that this is i also want to probably reduce it because it is too loud and the shots somewhere here and sorry let me increase it so the heads up also that's hands up also yes comes this way increase it let me increase the distance a little bit right so i've been able to set my keys for the individual samples right so i think that that makes the work easier right that makes the work easier for everyone or for every virtual dj enthusiast so that is going to be about this one in our next video, I am going to also show another way around in manipulating the volume of the of your samplers, right? So if you found value in this video, be sure to smash that subscribe button, like and share to other virtual DJ enthusiasts. I might also want to commend everyone for their support after my previous video, that is my, my last release video, my subscribers significantly increased, but i am also sure that we can do more than this so if you still haven't subscribed to the channel be sure to subscribe and then don't forget to share and one important thing turn on your notifications so that anytime i release a new video you will be notified all right so i'll come your way with another video but so then be safe